Why did a 5.1 magnitude earthquake cause one of the biggest volcanic eruptions in U.S. history? The morning of May 18, 1980 started like any other in Washington state. But at 8, 32 a.m., everything changed. A 5.1 magnitude earthquake triggered the largest landslide ever recorded. The north face of Mount St. Helens collapsed, releasing an enormous blast of volcanic ash, steam, and gas. The eruption sent a plume of ash 15 miles high into the sky, darkening the sun and turning day into night. Ash spread across 11 states, coating everything in a thick, gray blanket. This wasn't just any eruption, it was the most economically destructive volcanic event in U.S. history. Buildings were flattened, roads were buried, and rivers were clogged with debris. Tragically, 57 people lost their lives and countless animals perished. In the aftermath, the landscape was forever changed. The once lush forests were replaced by a barren wasteland. But over time, life began to return, proving nature's incredible resilience. Today, Mount St. Helens stands as a powerful reminder of the forces of nature. And the events of May 18, 1980, are a testament to the power and unpredictability of our planet. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more amazing stories from history.